Today for our lesson we are going to be using models or pictures to add like fractions. Here we have some fraction tiles just like last chapter and we want to add them. So if we're going to add each of these we want to know how many fifths we have. We have one fifth plus one fifth plus one fifth plus one fifth. We want to know what that equals. How many fifths do we have? It's pretty simple. We take our numerators and we have one, two, three, four. So we have four of these pieces and these are fifths. So we have four fifths. Today they're going to have two fractions and they're going to want you to add them. One easy way to do it is by using pictures or blocks. So I'm going to put my picture here. So I have 2 6 plus 3 6. I already circled one of my numerators already, so we just have to add them all up. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we have a total of 5, and these are sixths. So we have 5, 6. Notice that we only add the numerators. We don't add the denominators. We just keep that part the same because that's what we're adding. We're adding sixths, and we have five of them. So, one thing to make sure you remember. Okay, here's one. You might as well do this one along with me. So I have two eights plus three eighths. So if you want to draw that really quickly, you can. So here's two eights. And I want to add three more eights. And at least do this part with me. How many eighths do we have all together? Remember, we just add the numerator. We don't add the denominators. The denominator will stay the same. We want to know how many eighths we have. So eighths is going to stay. So how many of those eighths do we have? One, two, three, four, five. We have five eighths. So we put our five there in our numerator. We want to keep that eight the same. So we have five eighths. Okay. One slightly different. We're going to start with a picture. We want you to add this together and to write an addition sentence for each model and then find the sum. So our first circle, how much do we have? What's our fraction that we're going to be adding? It is one fourth. Then we need to add the other circle. How many fourths do we have in that one? So two fourths. And here's our addition sentence. One fourth plus two fourth equals, and then we need to find the sum. So once again, we just add our numerators. So we have one plus two more. So one, two, three. So our answer is three, and these are fourths. So three fourths is our answer. I think you're ready to do four on your own. So number one, if I have one third, and I get one more third, how many thirds do I have? Number two, four sixths plus one more sixth equals what? Number three, four tenths plus three tenths. Last of all, we have one of these that's the opposite. I have the picture. I want you to write an addition sentence and then find the sum. When you're done with those four problems, bring them into class tomorrow 
and have a wonderful evening.